Okay, boys and girls, today we're going to use this Venn diagram to compare teachers and principals. And what a Venn diagram is, is it takes two things, compare it, and then in the middle, you think about what's the same in your two categories. So we're going to talk about the roles of teachers and the roles of principals, uh, what they do, uh, and then we're also going to talk about things that might be the same about both teachers and principals. So let's get started. I'm going to grab a pen. Okay, so we're going to talk about teachers first. Think about the main job of a teacher. Well, the main job of a teacher is to teach children. So we're going to put teach students. So then we need to think about, well, what's the main job of a principal? Well, the main job of a principal is to be in charge of the whole entire school. That's their job. They don't come into our classroom to teach you. They are in charge of everyone. So they kind of walk around the school to see what's going on. So the main job of a principal is to be So their job is to be in charge of the school. All right, let's go back to teacher and think, what else can we say about a teacher? Well, the teacher makes rules for the classroom. It's one of our jobs. Okay, makes classroom rules. The principal, well, they're not in our classroom, right? So they make rules for what do you think? The whole school. So the principal makes school rules. I used the wrong color, I should have used pink. Ah! Um, all right, let's think about what else. Well, a teacher every day greets you in class. And do you know where the principal greets you? I know sometimes people take the bus and sometimes people are car riders. However, usually the principal greets you when you arrive. So either the vice principal's greeting you um, in the gym, or maybe it's, or when you're getting off the bus, or maybe it's the principal who's greeting you um, in the cafeteria. Oh, I said, use the word arrival. That means when you first get to school. All right, so we've got a lot that is different about teachers and principals. So we have teachers teaches, teach students, that's our main job, make classroom rules, and greet you in class. Principal, are, they're in charge of the entire school. They make the rules for the school, and they greet you when you arrive. So now let's think about things that are the same about both of them. And I know in our school you're thinking, well, Mrs. Federico, Mrs. Mongluza, Mrs. Uh, that we're all uh, women. However, that's not true for every classroom because we do have men teachers and we do have, there can be men principals. So we don't want to think about them like that. But we both work in a school. So work in a, okay. We are work members of the community. We work in the school. Um, we are leaders. Okay, we're leaders. We're people who are in charge, whether it's of the whole school or whether it's of our classroom. Okay, we're leaders. And I think one more we should say, not only are we leaders, but we are considered community helpers. So those are some things that are 
different. And then we have some things that are same. So let's just go over our list one more time. So teachers teach students, teachers make classroom rules, teachers greet you in class. A principal is in charge of the school. The principal makes school rules. The principal greets you at arrival or when you get to school. Uh, and then both teachers and principals, both of us work in a school. Both of us are leaders. Both of us are community helpers. Okay, so that's the difference between teachers and principals and some things that are the same.